it's a snow day and I woke up with a really big pimple on my cheek, but that's not the only unfortunate thing that happened. Nikki's car got stuck in the snow on a bridge. Colin went to save her and now she is snowed in with us today. Aw, it's like old times. We're gonna have a sleepover. We're gonna have a sleepover. <laughs> How was your Mix Easy um, shampoo and conditioner experience? You like tagged me. <laughs> Also, I got a chemical cut on my bangs, just like Nikki. It's like the universe just, you know, wanted to keep us twins. I love with this pimple and this bang. I don't know if you guys noticed, but Nikki got like a chemical cut, like she has a bang too. So now we have matching bangs and it's really funny. My house is a mess, please excuse it. That's because um, I was gonna film a certain video tomorrow and I think with the snow, I don't think that's gonna happen. Nikki and I are going to have a spa day today. Um, I have like a green face mask, I have like cleansing sponge things, I have body cream, skincare, I even got robes. I was gonna do a certain video this week, but I was like, you know what, I just wanna relax with Nikki. We're actually gonna be going to my parents' house for the snow day, I don't know if you guys know this, but like I live like right next to my parents. We can go over there now. My parents are doctors, so they were fortunate enough to get vaccines. So I'm just gonna be packing some things to head to my parents. I really wasn't anticipating vlogging today, but yeah, I haven't filmed like in Pink Wonderland in so long. Snow days are so beautiful over there. Not that they're not here, I really appreciate it here, but you'll see what I mean. Cue the fancy vlog music. <laughs> Post Nikki shower in the castaway cottage. <laughs> this is seriously the messiest my closet has ever been. So please ignore it. But I'm packing my things and Colin, Nikki and I are gonna spend the night at my parents. Look, this is everything I was supposed to do today. I have a planner. No, I'm just enjoying my day. I haven't done that in so long. I'm probably gonna be talking about wedding stuff with my parents tonight. Yesterday, Colin and I just made a really big change. So there's just been a big change that we decided, a great change. But yeah, I'm gonna finish packing and we're gonna head to my parents. Ready to go? Yeah, wow. <laughs> so beautiful. I didn't wanna go snowboarding so bad. I know. We're having a sleepover. <laughs> spa day that I told you guys about. <laughs> Nikki's TikTok. Like my sister vlogging again, makeup. <laughs> Colin, you look so good. I love you in a silk rope. Ooh. Ooh. So, as you can see, my minions are matching me. <laughs> they made me. We're gonna do the this like clay mask. It's like a, it's a, gl like a glue stick. A glue oh. stick face mask? It looks like a glue stick, but it's a face mask. So make sure you have no makeup on before you do this. I mean, <laughs> oh yeah, let me get. Why is it turning off. that color? It's supposed to be this color. Here, here's your stick in case you don't feel comfortable sharing. Whoa, really? sponges on Amazon all you have to do is wet them in the sink and it turns into like a round sponge then you can take your face mask off 
without ruining a washcloth. I haven't worn makeup in a few days, so I'm so excited to wear my makeup tomorrow. I'm actually putting together my office my new office at home, you'll get a reveal in this vlog. But I'm also launching my So Close, which is basically a subscription to see my close friends Instagram stories. So I'll be posting behind the scenes of Nikki and Gabby filming this week. And I'll also be posting like behind the scenes of like these vlogs and stuff. And yeah, tomorrow's gonna be fun. I can't wait to do my makeup. Does that, do you guys agree? Like whenever like your face feels nice and fresh, you're just so excited to do your makeup. I can't wait for tomorrow just simply to do my makeup. So Nikki's TikTok. TikTok. Nikki made a TikTok of our spa night with Colin. That's in this vlog. It's in this literal vlog right now. One second, it had like 40K views we, when she just uploaded it, and then she just opened TikTok. Like right now. Like right now, and it has like over, over a million, 1 million views. views. It's at 1.3 million, and just five minutes ago, it was 1 million. Oh, are you okay? It's now. It's, it's getting 100,000 views per minute, I'm scared. And we didn't know why it went viral until we read the comments. In the one part of the TikTok, like Nikki has like the little text voice explaining like- What's going on? What's going on in the TikTok. And in one part of the TikTok she goes, cause Colin's putting like her silk robe around her, like when she's in a sweatshirt or something. And uh, Nikki made the text voice say, <laughs> Her fiance wants me to wear a robe. That's it. I didn't even think because we're all so comfortable. Like I don't realize that looks wrong to other people because that's so normal for us. Nikki has her little edgy style. She likes to style anything she wears, even if it's a robe. So Nikki like styled it like where the space in between her hahas, like where it was like spread apart a little bit, because that's just how Nikki that's styles just how things. I am. And everyone's reading into that. They're like she wore her robe like that around her sister's fiance. Dude, that is weird. It's not weird. It's literally just a spa night that we were trying to have. Like, you guys saw me, like, this morning in this vlog be like, we're gonna have a spa night tonight. Nikki and I are going to have a spa day today. 1.4 million views. <gasps> TikTok is, like, vicious. People try to make a scenario out of anything. Also, if you guys didn't know, Nikki and I made a Nikki and Gabby TikTok right here, and we are starting our collab TikTok. And in the bio of our TikTok, you'll find out on March 1st, we are returning to YouTube together. Um, but yeah, we're gonna continue to collab on that joint TikTok account, collab on YouTube and TikTok, and yeah, as you can see, we've been hanging out. My thing is third wheeling. <laughs> oh yeah, everyone must be wondering where Nate is. Nate is snowed in he, in their apartment. You know what? I'm happy I found something that doesn't involve him because he deserves to be at peace behind the camera where he enjoys to be and I found you guys to make content with and I want to make content so everyone's happy. Yeah. Everyone was saying us three look cute though. 400k likes. Uh, Gabby. Yeah, maybe just don't read the comments. Uh, people are sitting through this shit. Good morning guys. So it's the next day. It's 50 degrees. The snow is melting. Colin's at work and his birthday is tomorrow and I'm gonna pick up some stuff for him today. Um, I'm actually gonna set up this cute little display outside. I know the snow is melting but when it starts getting like darker outside he's gonna be coming home from work so I think it would be super cute to set up like this cute little like renaissance medieval like dinner display. But also since I'm gonna be going to Home Goods and like Hobby Lobby, our favorite, um, to look for items for his little medieval feast, I'm going to be looking for Easter decor for my Gabster vlogs I'm preparing but I wanted to tell you guys i'm doing something for the first time in a while wait for it it's been a really long time since i said this and that is buying myself a luxury bag i haven't done this in a long time i feel like i just like needed to cleanse my soul from the amount of crap that i've bought so now when i buy a bag or something luxury i know i really want it and i've been thinking about it for a very long time i feel like when the world goes back to normal i'll do more like shopping spree vlogs where like we go to the mall together but for now oh my god no i just put two three of the same bag in my cart no sometimes i buy like multiple of one thing and i am not going to do that with a luxury bag Hello. I love, 
don't know if it's just me, but like when you come home from running errands, like don't your dogs look extra cute? Okay guys, so here's everything I got for Colin's little birthday setup. Over here is like antique gifts that I'm gonna wrap with this cute little like woodsy wrapping paper. But everything here is for the little medieval feast outside. And if you guys wanna see how that ends up, check out my TikTok because I'm not gonna be vlogging tomorrow. And I'm gonna be food shopping and making a medieval stew to like put in these bowls. They're all wet because I just washed them because they're antiques. But yeah, if you guys wanna see how that turns out, definitely check out my TikTok page. I also got this garland at Walmart and I just put it across the bed cause it just looks super cute. It makes me happy. And of course, per usual, my assistants and I put Easter eggs on the chandelier to make it an Easter tree. I'm currently in the new princess cave, which is my office slash Gap 20 antiques. And I'm gonna show you guys like a little like brief tour at the end of this vlog. Just make sure you know like it's still in the works, like really much in the works. So don't look at this as a finished product. But I wanted to show you that when I was shopping for Colin's birthday, I got all these flowers and I picked up some Easter antiques. We actually just posted a lot of Easter decorations right now if you guys wanna check out the antique shop. All right guys, so I was wearing this all while running errands and I feel disgusting. So I'm gonna go take a shower and then go throw on some comfy sweats and do my makeup. I would eat in front of you guys because I think I told you I have not been hungry lately. I told you that in like the Q&A about Nikki and I. And um, so I got chicken chow mein and egg rolls and sweet and sour dip. And I guess I'm gonna mukbang. Yeah. So tomorrow is Colin's birthday. It's his first birthday being a fiance. I'm not really a cook, I'm good at baking, but I wanna attempt to make this medieval stew and use like these iron like pots and stuff. I'm gonna do a try on haul after this. <laughs> I bought so many new clothes from Shein. No, Lily, it's not for you. I'm not sponsored by them, but I'm gonna do a try on haul because my package finally arrived. Look at me. Who do I think I am with this pinky? <laughs> I've never eaten this before, chicken chow mein. And after my try on haul, I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek of my new office in the basement. When it's summer, we like to go out into the outdoor cottage for like all the antiques and stuff. But um, when it's winter, it's like really hard to go in there because it's not insulated. So we've been working gap toinettes from like my closet to like the living room, to this kitchen table, to my desk, from my attic with all the storage. And we just needed one spot for everything on display. The printer, the boxes, the clothes. No, not for you, honey. I'm already full. Okay guys, so this is outfit number one from my Shein purchase. I love this dress so much. It's so ethereal and princessy. It's like a modern day Renaissance princess. I love this so much. It's so pretty. I honestly would just wear this around the house for fun, just to feel like a princess. So this is outfit number two. I ordered this because it reminded me of Mamma Mia and I freaking love the pants. Like I feel like I'll end up wearing these pants multiple, multiple times. I'm obsessed with them. I know everyone's probably gonna shit on them because they look like curtains, but 
but I've been loving patterns lately and I've been loving experimenting with different styles. As you guys have noticed on TikTok, oh my gosh, this was rolled up. I've been loving experimenting with outfits that I wouldn't just like pick out like automatically. And this one I stared at it a few times and then I bought it and it's actually ending up being one of my favorite outfits I own. I love the puff sleeves. I love the whimsical pattern. It's like this pretty paisley pattern. This is my favorite color blue. And I love the pistachio and lavender involved in it. It's just a vibe. Then I got this dress. It's like this cream color and it has double puff sleeves and buttons. And it just reminds me of a Disney princess. I do love Shein's outfits for this very purpose that they sell like every trend. They have cottage core everything and it's really hard to find stuff like that. So these other outfits are lingerie. This is a veil I got just for like fun little adventures, like eventually a bachelorette party or something. But then I got this like see-through nighty for obvious reasons I'm not going to wear this on camera. <laughs> comes with that, it's not a mask. And then I got this lace top with a bow. I feel like it would make a cute top with jeans if I put like some kind of padding underneath. Um, it reminds me of stuff that I sell on my antique shop, so that's why I loved it. I was really drawn to it. And a veil clip-in, so I guess I have two veils now. You know, just a mini haul. I figured I'd show you guys. And now I'm gonna reveal to you the new princess cave, but it's not gonna be called that now. It's, I don't know what it's gonna be called. I'm gonna come up with a name for it. I was thinking about calling it the lovely lair. I know it's really cheesy, but anyways, I'm gonna show you. Please don't judge. We just started fixing it up. We, we didn't even move like the sofas down there. Use your imagination. Are you guys ready? So you still get this picture of me and the Yorkie. I took this photo in LA. <laughs> this isn't Lily or Buddy. Um, it was just a shoot. Um, I still put that back up, but you get the laundry is still over here. I just decided to make it a little cuter. Um, sorry, I put the laundry basket in that tub but this is a sink, so it's like a little sink and mirror. Oops, when your laundry space is super pretty, it makes it so much more fun. We don't have much to it yet, but the walls are light blue, and yeah, this is what we have so far. We put the packages here, and then this is where we have the items that sold. We put them in here, and then we print labels here, and over here is like where all the boxes and tissue paper and everything is. Um, as you can see, we have a beautiful mess fragrance right here because we spray our items with beautiful mess in case you're interested in what beautiful mess smells like before you actually buy it. Our antiques smell like it. The only thing on this wall right now, I love this wallpaper, but the only thing on this wall is this mirror. Guys, please don't judge what the basement looks like right now, but I, lo I personally love it so far. And over over here is inventory like the gowns and stuff and then on this rack are the items that are still available on the site and so are these bags right here um, and right here it's not a makeup vanity per se but if I wanted to do my makeup down here I totally could but this is kind of like my workspace down here and then for now I have the gold throne but we have that big gold fancy couch from Cinderella Cottage that we're gonna put against this back wall. And then we're gonna bring down photo shoot props to take the photos of the items that we're selling online. And my favorite Love Shack fancy blanket from the last vlog. Overall, it's super simple, but um, this is what it is so far. I feel like you guys have been so curious ever since I posted on Instagram. We still have the 90s and stuff in this wardrobe. I think I want to leave it open, kind of like a store. And then we have some kind of island going down here where we're going to put like a tea set and all like the glass antiques. And then another table where we're going to put like the foldable like sweaters and stuff. But yeah, this is what we have done. We're going to hang up a TV so I can watch some Audrey Hepburn while I'm crafting. I have some of my crafting stuff down here because I also love to add my own little finishing touch to the antiques that we have. Um, But yeah. So that's it for this fancy vlog. Sorry, this was such a random one. I was not expecting to vlog yesterday or today. But yeah, that's this vlog. This was very random. But I loved it so much, and I hope you guys did too. And stay tuned for my next fancy vlog. I love you so much, and I will see you guys in my next fancy vlog.